I'm your best friend, Chopsicle the Dog, and this is Monster Restaurant in Real Life. Whoa, what a huge Cyclops. And he's going after that fairy. Oh, it just rips open the roof. That thing is a beast. Look at the scars on his chest. <laughs> oh, she's got the fairy wings. Oh, and that's the monster restaurant. Are you sure this is the right place? Oh! Yeah, this is the right place. We need to find the owner. Uh, Stylo and the gang have Hi, found this guys. Raylo. Whoa, we feels in this place are free? No, no, they're not. Who said that? I found him. <laughs> no free refills. By the name Raver. I heard that this was the place to find a guy like <sighs> Yeah, this is the place for it. And? And I'm not your dad. Scram, kid. Hey, you took our money. Listen, sir. This could be your only chance to find your mom. We really need this. Not my problem. Shit, <laughs> hello. I've got this one. <laughs> the Goliath is coming for restaurant room. It's awake and it's going to eat everything. The Goliath. <laughs> They're going to need a David. <laughs> We have dealt with enough world-ending monsters. We do not need another one. Okay, I've read the stories, and they are all true. Please, please, just please listen to me. Okay, if we don't feed it, it will eat everything. Oh, they've got to feed it so it won't be hungry enough to eat them all. Please. Why won't anybody listen to me? I bet Shiloh will. Did you see it? It ate my grandfather's village. Please, they don't know it, but we need your help. We'll help you. Right, guys? <laughs> They're just gone. They're like, peace out. Contact with her. <laughs> they just ghosted her. Okay. 400 years ago, the Goliath ate half of Restaurant Row before the master cooks were able to feed it the right delicious food to satisfy its appetite. And it won't eat the same dish twice. How far away is it? I saw it by the Trojan Forest, so it's on its way. How many football fields is that? Why is there a blank page? That book I, looks so cool. But it was supposed to be asleep for a thousand years. I don't know why it woke up early. We would need a huge restaurant to make enough food to defeat him. Yeah, but the restaurant owners around here won't help us. So? We flee this, Raylo, scratch it off our list of friendlies, grab a nap, and maybe some pasta. The tractor still owns Definitely nap. Take a Wait. nap. <laughs> so we build our own restaurant. Build it? It sounds like that would take a really long time. The restaurant my fairy godmother left me. Although in Roblox, you just step on little circles. <laughs> we use the money we get for the customers to upgrade the restaurant. We need to make this place big enough to feed the Goliath. I'm sorry that it's not much to work with. Don't say that! This is absolutely nothing to work with. <laughs> that table just needed to rest. Uh... <laughs> All right, team, we are the cooks! Three customers, customers will be coming to the... Okay, what are you doing? I'm trying to lead my team. What are you doing? <laughs> trying to lead your team? What's the first step in fairy cooking? <laughs> Why does it have to be fairy fairies, cooking? Right? <laughs> That's great. You have no experience, so you'll be on dishes because that is the perfect job for a human. Okay. Oh, that what is, is discrimination <laughs> against humans. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. We're Not gonna good. Need a lot of customers to defeat this thing. Two. Two customers. We're gonna need two customers. Got it. I will also be in charge of karaoke nights and social media posts. <laughs> These people don't have social media? He's the entertainment okay, director. Karaoke <laughs> nights? Score! That means I only have to invent social media. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Randy Shadow got us two fairy customers. Judah, you can't kidnap two fairies as customers. That's illegal! 
Shiloh, Shiloh, Shiloh. Which one's more illegal? Briefly inconveniencing two fairies or having a bad opening day? Kidnapping two fairies. <laughs> okay, How then. does she know what's illegal on that, Raylo? Oh, wow, a restaurant. I am hungry. See, Shiloh? Can I interest you in grow flowers with sauteed butterflies and crystal pebbles? Hmm, what do you recommend? None of them. <laughs> None of them. What does your heart tell you? The butterflies. Then we'll go with the butterflies. Oh, that's one so gross. One <laughs> you can't eat pretty butterflies, no way. Oh man! Wow! Some of them are amazing. flying. That's awful. Make it like cockroaches or something. Oh, he's trying to make it taste good for a human, but it might not taste good for a monster. Should all be finished. Oh. oh my God. I, this uh, tastes like mac and cheese, not like sycamore root soup. Like this mac and cheese. <laughs> everybody's counting on this food. I don't know. Get out! Get out! Get out and think about what you've done. Okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> you gotta tell her it was you. <laughs> Come on, dude. At <laughs> least you're still cleaning. Mm. With his bare mm -hmm. hand. Let's move this people away from the wall. Shiloh, those customers haven't heard about the tracker either. Oh, well, that's okay. Keep asking about him, though. Woke up too early. Let's see what you can find in that book of yours. I can do that. Wait, she's the one cooking. They're really liking our food. At this rate, we won't have enough money to upgrade the restaurant in time to stop the Goliath. We need more customers. Oh, there's some monsters right there. Uh, what kind of food do you serve here? We have uh, assorted butterflies, flower garden medley, and pearl and crystal soup. Oh, that's not a nice way to handle it. <laughs> Dude. Yeah, who needs those guys anyway? We do. They're going to have to expand the menu. We need to serve monster customers if we want any chance at defeating the Goliath. We have to learn how to make monster food. Mashed spider guts, lizard ribs, and mystery meat burgers? How is that better than eating grow? butterflies? Who? Me? I don't know. Amiga, you've really never grilled before? I haven't. I don't know. Pick me! Come on, Terrence, <laughs> anything? I've never eaten monster food before. I'm standing right here! Okay, well, I guess we're just gonna have to learn how to grill some ribs. <laughs> Lunch yeah. serving humans? Why does it say that we're serving humans? Because our servers are humans. <laughs> we are humans that serve. <laughs> we are humans that serve. <laughs> Make a new sign. Okay. <laughs> Where are, where are, where are? Hi, how can I help you? Get me a new drink. Something's wrong with this one. That's the third drink I've gotten. Give it to me. Let me see. <laughs> Tastes like a little baby's been drinking out of it. Oh! Yeah, yeah, it was. Have a oh. nice day. <laughs> that drink was disgusting. Our kitchen has to get it together. Why she <laughs> harassed him? None of this is working, and all the customers are complaining. Well, if I could just help you, get I am just trying to think. Please. Just you can do it. it. Stand up for yourself. Up. There well, it I mean, is. those ribs he turned down, those wings have entirely too many spices in it. Terrence, you call yourself a cook? This meat is so undercooked, it's practically running away! <laughs> He's yes, Gordon sir. Ramsay! That's more like it! <laughs> Come on, wait, go, go. Oh no, he's copying his favorite British chef. Hold up, let him cook. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's gonna all of a sudden make him a great cook. <laughs> That's all it takes, just copy them. Thank you. Coming in soon. The monster food's a big hit. That customer had heard of Raver before. He lives around here. 
Humans we are friends, on not food. Eyeball Wellington. Let's get on the double. Keep those tentacles out of sizzle. Yes, sir. Whoa, Who he's tall. My name's Falafel, sir. I'm a new hire. I'm really good at making falafels. <laughs> I like you, Falafel. Terrence! Why can't you ever be this professional, Terrence? Make sure he doesn't mess anything up. His name is Falafel, and he makes falafels. <laughs> customers. She's doing great. Hey, you're paying for that. Get back here. <laughs> Have you heard anything? No customers heard of Raver the Tracker. There he is. Oh, hold on. Michelle's trying to sort out another tavern brawl. Michelle, put down the floor. I can't go again. There's that book again. It's so cool. Whoa! What'd she paint it with? Is that blood? Okay. You know who Raver is. Go away, kid. Raver got lost a long time ago. People have said they've seen him around, so that cannot be true. How do you know him? Well, I used to know him. You're Raver. You're who I'm looking for. She figured it out. Nine more. Stop chasing ghosts. No, please. It's about my mom, and we can help. Why doesn't anyone on this really want to help anyone? They're not better than us. Now get lost. What was he doing in a monster restaurant anyway? <laughs> Shiloh, we have a big problem. Shiloh was right about the blank page. The old chefs used to write their recipes in this hidden ink, and it would only appear using tomato soup. Oh, tomato soup! <laughs> <laughs> he just keeps breaking tables. <laughs> so, the new page says that the only way to get the Goliath to go back into its slumber is to feed it five schools of food. Monster, fairy, human food, mermaid meals, and goblin cuisine. Well, human food, I know. Right, and mermaid meals, they shouldn't be too hard. So the problem is the goblin cuisine. There are no written recipes for it. The restaurant owners are the master cooks and they are the only ones that know how to make the food. So let's just ask them. Or we could do it my way. Your way would get us arrested. But it would <laughs> give us the recipes. Okay, but they're just, they're snobs. They will only give the recipes to restaurants that they deem worthy. Oh, gonna they're going to have to fanciest pants. live up to the test. <laughs> All right, they're fixing the place up. Judah's got his fancy pants. Look at that giant. <laughs> that would be big, like, even if it was like like the accurate size for a giant there, that would be still gigantic. <laughs> They're here. Right this way. We have exemplary serving staff and overwhelmingly positive reviews from our customers. Oh, and here are head waiters, Mike and Michelle. Oh, they're the uh, critics. Wait, there's something wrong with my food. Hmm, taste it. <laughs> I'm not eating it. But remember, with good customer service, the customer is always right. <laughs> He's like, you eat it. They're all looking to see. <laughs> uh, of course. <laughs> I couldn't possibly take this honor from Michelle here. No, I think, Micah, <laughs> you should do the honor. No, no, no. I couldn't possibly. <laughs> <laughs> Brutal, Michelle. Uh, Olga toenails. That's what's missing. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh no. Definitely oh, needs ogre toenails. <laughs> <laughs> I say that like every day. Oh, every oh, time I'm cooking, I'm like, needs more ogre toenails. Snail souffle. And you're the head chef? Yes, I am. Well, actually, we're more of a couple. <laughs> They're leaving. <laughs> oh, awful. This is beautiful. You have done such a tremendous work, and you tear it! You mess up the whipped green terrace that's crooked! Look at what you've done! Go! Stay in the corner! Terrence! Well, I'd say that went pretty well with the master cooks. 
<laughs> and for the music curation, I went with a classic Earth piece, which immortalized the phrase, skibbity dop 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 yes yes. <laughs> the skibbity toilet song. <laughs> Man, Raver's just hanging out here all the time for somebody who doesn't to want to with. talk to them. If it's money you need, I can get it. It's still a no. Is someone threatening you? Listen, kid, a no is a no. You want to do it. You just can't. He's scared. He's scared. I didn't make my tracking device. I found it in an old tomb. A job went bad and it broke. I've been trying to get it fixed, but I can't. No one knows who built it. Why didn't you just say that instead of just being Sorry. all mean? <laughs> You're on your own. Shiloh, we need you over here. We finished our report as to whether you are worthy of our knowledge of goblin cuisine. That's wonderful. And? Food, five stars. Oh, good. Environment, five stars. Service, five stars. That's perfect. So, our verdict, denied. What? What? Well, why are you denying us? We passed all your tests. We feel that you're not on the same level as us. And we don't want another restaurant here. Or, or at least not by you. Oh, they're being dis it's discrimination. Don't you understand? We're trying to save your town. We don't have to be here. That Goliath is coming for you and it's going to destroy everything. Why don't you care? You... You knew it was coming. They but want it to come. How? You're on your own. Run while you still can. Oh, they're evil. No. Something isn't right. Elijah in the kitchen, try and make some goblin cuisine. The Goliath will be here by sunrise. Then we need to succeed. And we're going to. <laughs> That's his third okay. table. <laughs> Does anyone know how to fix a table? I have a list of the names of goblin dishes, but we don't know anything about goblin cuisine. This is what we'll have to work with. Let's get those ovens on! We can't have any mistakes! <laughs> Terrence, what are you? An idiot sandwich! That's right! Oh, so Gordon Ramsay! Give me back my wallet! Okay, here you go. You told me my last dog was in here! Oh no, he's still lost. <laughs> All the restaurants were packed up. <laughs> Look, we are not helping. You all knew that the Goliath was coming, but it woke up 600 years too early. What did you do? We didn't do anything. Yeah, right. You hear that? That's the sound of my friends locking all of the doors from the outside which means that none of us are leaving until you tell me how you caused this 600 years too early. Look, the Goliath sleeps under a field of mushrooms, okay? The fungus kept him asleep while he grew hungry for a thousand years. We found out the mushrooms were delicious and our customers loved them. After we had harvested most of them, we realized our mistake. You? Harvested them? It's a lot like the rainforest. The larger says we need it. Deforestation. Well, Lila says we need this for the new goblin fungus gelato. And nothing you're doing is working. Well, Elijah thinks you're not a good cook. Well, then you can send this to Elijah. Oh, no. Food fight. Oh, man. It's on. <laughs> All right. Don't throw salad. That's not going to work. Go for the soups. Go for the ketchup and mustard. <laughs> Whatever that blue stuff you is. This. So fix it. We told you we're not helping. Listen, I know you're scared. I'm scared, but we have to try. Look, we're we're not as skilled as the masters were 400 years ago. Okay, we 
We, we can't do it. Oh, they don't even home. probably know them anymore, the goblin recipes. far from here. We'll be fine. Get out while you can, okay? Or you're just gonna get swept away too. Some master chefs you are. They're cowards. You have the chance to save everyone with your food. The, the doors weren't locked. The doors were They're never locked. To be. <laughs> Where's the key? Put on the key. I thought you had it. Okay, quick. Make a door locking sound. I don't know how to make a door locking sound. You do it. <laughs> well, what the heck? When did you learn how to do that? That's like a perfect door <laughs> locking sound. We can't sound. get the goblin recipes to work. It never tastes right. Well, it can't be that bad. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it was just the first bite. <laughs> No, he's fighting back. He just keeps we trying. We don't know what's in these recipes. We're just going off of names. Only the master chefs know them. There's a giant monster running this way. He's eating everything. Run! We're gonna have to find Dracula out if it's good enough. Coming, and we do not have the ability to stop it. The tracker was a dead end. These people don't even want to be saved. Shiloh, we can't stop it. I think it's going to be a tragedy. We're not better than them. We don't save people because they deserve it. It's what we're supposed to do. It's just what we do. Let's get cooking. It's actually my motto. Oh, don't do it because they deserve it. Do it because of who you are. As a person. Wait, no, 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 don't leave. Okay, why does it? Why does it like her? <laughs> okay, those lizard things grow medium rare. The fairy pearls properly marinated. Can I fluff and make me some butterfly fluffs? Do it. I'll manage. All right, they can you work together. I'll go help in the kitchen where I can. Here it comes. There it is. Look at that CG. Some they got some. My food. They got my some pretty great smell. CG for a YouTube video. <laughs> All right, me and Michelle will greet him at the door. Whoa! I don't think this guy uses doors. Just use a slingshot. That's you what David did. <laughs> David versus smell. the Goliath. Can I interest you in a menu? Whoa! I'll get your food out right away. Apparently his breath isn't that bad because they didn't even make a breath joke. <laughs> fairy food's ready! Now we're talking! Alright, they got the fairy food for him. First course, fairy food! Like, it's a lot of food, but is it like a lot for a Goliath? All right, time to bring more. Oh, those are perfect. All right, the monster food. All right, now they need it. The Where goblin food. Oh, maybe they're not on the goblin food yet. This is human food. Goblin food is next. And we'll give it our best shot. Let's go, fairies! Yeah. All right, here's the goblin food. Oh, don't be like our goblin food. Maybe he'll be gobbling it all up. <laughs> Dad joke. <laughs> oh, he wouldn't even eat it. Oh, they 
came back. We have your goblin food. This should be some proper goblin food for you. You came back. This girl talked some sense into me. Yeah. Said I should save the world or something. Oh, there he's grabbing it. He eats it. Was it good? Oh, now he can rest. So is he going to go sleep for like another thousand years? <laughs> wow. So this is the restaurant I heard about on the post. In a what now? A Judah talk. It's a thing called social media. <laughs> social media. Come on, man. Judah. Thank you for seeing us. That's awesome. Us. And me. Anytime. What happens to the restaurant now? It's yours. Oh, it's her restaurant now. We know you'll take good care of it. Thanks for everything. I know that I made some mistakes in there, but will you come back? Oh, we'll be back. You know, just check in on things every once in a while. I mean, we'll see. <laughs> We knew you needed Raver's tracker. When restaurant owners like us work together, there isn't anyone we can't find. There he is. Their guy actually fixed it. Where's some DNA of the person you want me to find? Well, he thinks it's fixed. Well, they've got her DNA. This is some of her hair. I'm sorry, but she doesn't exist. Whoa. You mean she's dead? No. If she was dead, I'd be able to find her. She's gone, gone. She doesn't exist. Not good. What happened to their mom? All right. <laughs> Good job. Please share this with your friends and like the video so that I know you want to see more videos like this.